A lot of women was alone this Valentine's Day. Their standards was very high. It felt like they nobody was on their level and they deserved a better man with more money, they looked better, that was taller, or a different type of personality. They just think they better than everybody that come their way. And what do they got to offer? Other than their beauty and cheeks behind. What do they got to offer? They feel like they better than every man they come to. Even if he look better than them, if he put a wig on. They still feel as though He's not good enough. He don't make enough money. He don't make enough money. Blah, 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 blah. The years are flying by. You don't supposed to settle for anything. But people change. Things change. Finances change in years. A lot of my clients were broke last year. And they're millionaires this year. Their businesses took off. Some of them inherited money. Some of them got hired and got high paying jobs. Some of them are in the NFL and the NBA now. Some of them started their own business up with, with the women that loved them for them. They figured out a way to get money. People, money can change, but most of the time, people don't change. You looking for love or you looking for luxury? Are you looking for a companion or are you looking for a lifestyle? Nobody wants to be poor. Nobody wants to struggle. But who gonna love you? Who gonna be there for you if you lose your behind? If your face gets some kind of skin disease, who's gonna be there for you? You think that handsome man gonna be there for you? Was you there for him when he was broke? You want him to be there with you when you things on your body started getting flat, and f soggy and flabby? Huh? Are you gonna pump your body up with silicone and plastic? Did you want him to put a bunch of fake Monopoly money in his pockets when he was broke? You're asking for stuff that you wouldn't want done to you. You can't expect to get good things if you're not